Yeah, so Voyager, Voyager set, or uh, uh, Voyager set anyway, is an 80 plus boulder that was first sighted by Ben Moon. Fucking yes! Come on! Back in 2005, I think he did the stand, and then he added the sit start to that a year later in 2006. But I think the reason I really wanted to go and try it is because it is probably one of the best looking boulders in the UK. And uh, yeah, it had like quite a lot of attention over the years, but then about three years ago, the crux hold broke, like two of the pebbles in the middle, and it's got considerably worse. There were two beaters of doing the crux, Ben's original beater, and then people have been using like a more direct beater recently. Both of them use that hold. No one's been able to make those beaters work since. Why is this uh, the like gritstone problem I've been most keen for, I suppose? Uh, probably because it's not really like gritstone, you know, it's a... Uh, Unlike conventional, it's steep, overhanging, you're like pulling on holds rather than like sort of technically going off a slab. So <laughs> it's kind of like more like the limestone style of grit. So I think that's uh, that's why I've been really keen on it. <laughs> like in comparison to a lot of the other 8Bs I've done, and the problem is the only other one I've done on grit, I mean it's not many on grit, the only other 8B I've done on grit is the Ace. And I mean, it's quite different, but it's like miles easier than this, I think. And considering these are bo they're both like just pooling climbs, you know the the ace the crimp on it the crux hold is like a lot better than the one I'm using on this now. I was really keen to go and put some time in and see uh, see if it was still possible and see what it'd be like. So my first session on Voyager was after the first lockdown when we were allowed out in 2020. We went kind of in the evening as light was starting to fade because being in the summer it's definitely too hot for the for the grit stone, probably about 25 degrees too hot. But I kind of did the first move which is not so bad and did those end ones but wasn't able to try the crux move really. November, December of last year, 2021, I got back on it and had a really good session. It was like a cold day the first session back and was able to figure out beta that I thought would work for the move that where the hold had broken. So one of the reasons that Voyager is so difficult to climb is because not only is it obviously really hard moves, but the the holds are so small and sharp that it absolutely destroys your skin. So you can only have a maximum of about six to ten goes in a session if you're lucky. Last session I got super close to the move and was like, yeah, okay, it definitely works. So I was like, was sure the move would work. And then this session actually being able to stick it was, I mean, at the beginning on the first couple of goes, like actually sticking the move and then dropping it was like super satisfying to know that it, the problem still goes, the move still works. Like, I was like thinking, oh, I should have bumped again when I was like bringing the yeah, yeah, yeah. so, so I've got 
<laughs> yeah, good. It's such a good problem. Um, just like learning the move just took a while, but like in the end, it's like didn't quite hit the old right, the right hand, but just felt so solid in the position. Was just like able to like sketch through to the top instead of like four fingers with like three fingers. And when I hit that crimp, it's like full crimped on it, and I was like, just just pray it doesn't rip and hope for the best up there. Do I think it's been three years since the hold broke on it? Um, and. I don't think anyone's even done that move bar me today, so I don't know, it's a hard one. Like people have tried it a bit, so it and from the people that I spoke to that tried it before and after, they do say it's got a lot harder. Now I didn't try it before, so that obviously is quite hard on the grade. I mean actually doing it, you know, it's never gonna like with grit, when you actually do the climb, it always the goal just works so much better, it always feels a bit easier. But to be honest, that felt pretty hard through the top still. You know, it's like it's not many moves, and like I suppose if you had a lot of good days, a lot of good skin, you could come probably learn this quite well. But I don't know, it still felt like hot. I was I was pulling really hard through the top, so I definitely think it's more on the 80 plus side. Are we willing to say? To be honest, like it's the upper moves that are what make this climb. The low is just adding a couple moves of difficulty, really. Um, I'm I'm psyched to try it definitely, but like it's. Uh, it's the upper moves that got me the most sight for it, so doing the stand was like my main goal.